Hey, what's going on everyone? Dave here with more Majora's Mask. Let's just throw a balloon, a bubble, at this balloon. And whoa! Awesome! If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and hit the bell notification ringer to get more updates on episodes. Watch me freak out little boys like this one. Are you the one who just popped that up there? Not bad for a Deku scrub. We bombers have a hideout that leads to the observatory outside town. You need a code to get in. Maybe I'll tell you what it is. But don't think you're getting it that easily. I'll tell you what the code is, but you have to pass my test. Are you ready? Cool. So, I need to find all five of these chillin' by tomorrow morning. Jesus Christ. And, haha, you fell down. But they're really easy. I do have their locations internalized. The code actually does change from save file to save file and game to game. So, I don't know what it is, honestly, off the top of my head. But I already found one of them. And the other one's back here. I think this one's Jim the Leader, right? Let's find out. There he is. Yep, that's him. And I got him cornered. I got this cool little spin that helps me go a little bit faster. Nevertheless, not too bad. And this is another really cool part of the game because I think it's a great way of giving you a mandatory thing that also forces you to explore town. And again, I'm not going to talk to every single person in town because I already kind of know what the deal is. Nevertheless, oh yeah, like we got to go to the bank guy anyway and this gave me a good reason to end up there. So, I think just the beginning of this game is designed so dang well. Come here, little boy! <laughs> Alright. Oh, jeez. No, more reasons why I'll never be elected president. Okay, no. Not the shield. Okay, there we go. And... Oh, I wonder if I can show this off real quick. Because I did want to talk about how some people don't like me. Well, this guy's got some crazy back, is back issues. Alright. Welcome, what are you, a Deku Scrubs kid? You can't play here. If you want something, bring one of your parents. So yeah, I literally cannot buy merch. Hey, Scarecrow, what's up? I, I can't. It just won't let me. Okay, so, hello, sir. My name is Deku Scrub. Hey, there, it looks like he's patting my head vigorously. Hey there, little guy, why don't you deposit some rupees? Nowadays, even if people have money, they don't deposit any. Nothing, nothing. So, for a limited time, I'll give you a special gift base. Yeah, that's actually really cool. They say animals have an instinctive intuition with when d disasters are going to happen. So it kind of makes sense that people are pulling out of their savings accounts. Nevertheless, I'm privy to some special information. So actually, I don't want to get rid of all of it. Let me, let me put in 70. Yeah. Yeah, I'll put in 70. Because I do want to have some to do the Deku Scrub game next time. Dave, is it? Got it. I won't, make, I won't forget your deposits. Let me stamp you with my special ink. This is the best and coolest thing about this game. It's uh, not gonna hurt. Yeah, cool. So that totally did not touch me, by the way. Now I'll know you when I see you. Okay, cool. So he put a stamp on my head, basically, that says how many rupees I have in the bank and my name. And he's a banker, so he's got tons of clients. He won't, like, remember me, but he'll be like, oh, that's my stamp. And so it's like having a bank account with a certain am amount of money in it. Which is super cool, because I will go, spoiler alert, if you guys who know Majora's Mask, when I redo this cycle, when I redo any cycle, he'll be like, oh, yeah, you have this much in the bank, sure. And so I'm basically kind of cheating the system. Okay, this guy's going to jump off. Do you believe me? Where is he? There he is. Aha! Okay, oh, he's going to make a nuisance of himself. Let's show this off. Yeah, you can just bubble him and make everything really easy. I don't like doing it, but he seemed like he was going to give me problems. So, and now we've got this guy, who's cuckoo for cuckoos, and he's going to just fly. Whee! If you shoot him with a bubble, you can actually hit him before he starts flying, but as you can see, he was pretty easy to get to him anyway. And I wanted to show off him flying. And that's how I learned, by the way, that you can fly with a cuckoo, because remember, I played this game before I played Ocarina. Could give you a bomber's notebook, make you a member. What do you guys think? No way, no scrubs. Oh, oh, yeah. A passenger side of his best friend's ride, trying to holler at me. Boy, do we ever regret it. Oh, we let a guy who was not a uh, human uh, join the club, and we regretted it. Ugh, gross. All right, here we go. But yeah. But if you're a Hylian, they'll let you in. It's the truth. It's the truth. So we'll go. And is there anything else I need to do? 
No. Yeah, I'm pretty good. I'm golden, actually. Because all I need to worry about now is... I forgot the code. Honestly, I didn't even memorize it. I was too busy talking. Okay. Wait, what? Are you serious? Come on, help me out, dude! I didn't! No! Oh, no. Oh, come on, one of the other guys has to tell it to me. Hey, buddy, please tell me. Okay, thank you. 32145. Okay, 32145. 32145. 32 ones are 45 years old. One, four, five. And yes, if you notice the frame rate's a little weird, I am playing on N64. I am. And it's a fact. <laughs> it's a total fact. I do have the GameCube version, but it just feels so much more legit with my joypad and... Eh, it's classic. Let's face it, guys. I'm a, I'm a big nostalgia nut. So, you gotta remember to say hi to that Deku scrub. After tomorrow morning and do continue with that hey buddy oh this is another cool thing I love about tattle what you don't even know about the skulltula it's protected by a hard shell but its stomach is soft yeah because the game I, I always thought she was just being like a jerk because again I played this game before Ocarina of Time but if you played Ocarina of Time it uses all the assets from that game so they assume you've played Ocarina of Time, and like, yeah, you totally ran into Skulltulas. And I love that they call that out by having her be like, you don't know about this thing? That's crazy. And it's so cool. I, I think that's, you know, it's little touches like that that really drive me nuts with, with these sort of games. In a good way, of course. Now, is that we have this stuff? Wow, it's like... I'm a really produ I'm being really productive today. I wish in my real life I could be this productive by midnight. Well, well, a strange looking child has joined me today. Are you a new friend of the Bombers Gang? Oh, your manners seem much better than those of your mischievous friend from the other day. <laughs> that old man had trouble to take up from the other day. He said he'd break my instruments. He said he'd steal my moon steer. There was no stopping him. Well, oh, did he steal it? No, he didn't steal it. Even now, just watch him. He's probably causing trouble around the clock tower. Will you gaze into the telescope? Don't mind me. I'll just be right behind you as you look through. Okay, cool. I'm gonna look through and be like, Oh, look, there's Death Mountain. Except it's not really Death Mountain. It's a swamp. And, oh, look, there's a tree. There's some rupees in the tree. Oh, fun, fun. What a lovely world this is. Termina is delightful. Oh, look, some mountains in the distance. Oh, fun, fun. And there's the clock tower. I wonder what's directly above it. Oh, hello, sir. <laughs> so if you zoom in... Okay, sorry. I, I think I'm too busy looking at his cavities. Uh, is this working? Anyway, th by the way, this is the moon from Majora's Mask. It's it's terrifying. And it's the reason I stopped playing this game. Okay, yeah, this is what you ne I need to look at. And he's looking up there and be like, Hey, what are you looking at, buddy? And that's where you're supposed to get introduced to the moon. Okay, so I kind of ruined it. I just kind of looked at his nasty cavities. And boom, there's the moon's tear. It's interesting, symbolically, why a moon steer exists. It makes you think, like, did he just conjure this moon and is bringing it down, or is it the actual moon of Termina? Also, he jumped into it. Okay, that's weird. Uh, so he, like, jumped into it. Oh, did you find that troublemaker? What was that? Perhaps another moon steer has fallen. But yeah, if the moon is falling, why is it crying? And if it's evil, why does it regret things? So it makes you wonder if this is actually a possessed moon, or if it's a conjured moon. If it's a conjured moon, I don't know why I'd be dropping tears. Unless it's a manifestation of the Skull Kid's possession. Ooh. And how he has no control over the destruction that he's soon about to rot on this world. Excellent. So yeah, he said he'd steal my Moonsteer and there was no stopping him, but apparently something was stopping him because your Moonsteer is right here. What could that... Wow, this angle is delightful. Okay, he's not... Okay, whatever. And guess what, guys? We have finished everything that we really need to do. So... I'm gonna head back to Clock Town, and I want- wait, actually, I wonder if this guy will dance with me. Hey, buddy. Scare- sound Scarecrow. Time will pass in the blink of eye. This is a great way to speed up time, by the way. We can dance till dawn, yes! 
Until dawn. <gasps> I would love to play that game, but I don't have the means to play it. So let's dance till dawn, and uh, we can go back, because it'll be the second day. We can do the Deku Scrub game, so that'll be fun. Dawn of the second day. Oh, I love that. cock -a doodle So, yeah, how was it? Okay, if you like, we can forget about time and dance until night. Yeah, no, 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 no. I'm fine. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this guy can, like, have you dance until the end of the world if you just keep saying yes to him. Oh, yeah, sure. If you play that mysterious song backward, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I can teach you this later. I don't even know why I said yes. Cool, cool. So, I'm gonna head back to Clock Town and we'll do the Deku Scrub game in the next episode. So, as always, if you like this video, make sure to like this video by leaving a little thumbs up. And if you want to keep stay up on tabs, subscribe with that bell notification ringer and we'll keep you posted. For now, though, this is Dave out. Peace out.